Governor Haley also toured a couple of homes today that were damaged by the record flooding six months ago. Still a mess to clean up. She wants to call attention to the fact that the recovery is still going on. She's asking for your help. 7 News reporter Robert Kittle was with her on that tour today and tells us how you can get involved. Mennonites from Pennsylvania who are volunteering their time are almost finished rebuilding Barbara Campbell's home in Sumter. It was almost completely underwater during the floods last October. I couldn't even describe it. It was nothing but a disaster. It's hard to picture right now, but the water here at Mrs. Campbell's house came up to here. Statewide, faith-based groups have provided more than $7 million worth of free labor, and the building materials have been supplied by the 1SC fund that Governor Nikki Haley started. She toured the home to see the progress. This may be in Sumter, but this is all over the state. And so we have faith-based groups right now, today, working on over 600 homes to get them rebuilt. And we can't stop because there's a lot of children who need to get back in their home. She's asking you to donate, if you can, to the 1SC fund. 100% of the money goes to building supplies. She also toured the home next door. Uh, what we needed to do is to replace the electrical system in total. Right. It's owned by 98-year-old Emma McClure, who's in an assisted living home until she can get back here. Her daughter grew up here and couldn't believe the flood damage. Just numb, um, especially to see um, all of my childhood memories just being heaped out in a pile on the side of the road. Her home still needs a lot of work, but it is getting done. I think seeing a house that's being started and seeing a house that's being finished, it keeps us motivated to say we got to keep going until we get every family back into their home. She's anxious to get back in her home. There's, um, there's no place like home. In Sumter, Robert Kittle, 7 News. So we told you you could help here. If you'd like to donate to that flood relief effort, you can go to the 1SC.org. That's 1SC.org. A link to it's on our homepage. Yeah, it's so wonderful to see how many organizations are stepping up to do that. And again, 100% of the money goes to building supplies.